What's up, fellow Clashers? It's Apollyon here, and I'm not bringing you the end of the war against the Pejuan Indo, or however you pronounce it. I'm bringing you towards the end of the war, and the reason is, is, uh, is, is, we are, uh, I've already finished uh, cleaning up Town Hall 9s. We will get a perfect war. There's a 99.999 repeating infinitely amount of times that we will get that, unless Supercell crashes the server for four hours or whatever. Uh, we've cleaned all their Town Hall 9s, and for some reason, we still have a couple of Town Hall 8s that need to be cleaned up, one, uh, two, and uh, one that hasn't even been hit yet. We have plenty of Town Hall 9 attackers available and Town Hall 8 attackers, so I know that will be done. Uh, these guys are a level 9 clan from Indonesia, so we appreciate the matchup. Um, and, uh, you know, again, another perfect war. So we're going to see a lot of cool attacks with Valk attacks this time. Go Val Hoes, Go Val Lows, a whole bunch of Valkyrie stuff. So Lang is going to start us off right here, and I will do a Town Hall, not, uh, Town Hall 8 uh, attacks video after this, but we haven't finished yet, so I'll, I'll wait for that to happen. Lang's going to go ahead and hit their number one base and prove that even a blind squirrel can get a nut every once in a while. Nope, nope, just kidding, just kidding. It's a good attack. I'm going to see a go va uh, low we So bring some witches in there with a quad quake. Open up that core completely. He uh, has a heal and two rages to push the, that uh, kill squad through. Uh, brings a shattered entry with the two golems, Max from the clan castle and one of his own. And starts the funnel from the uh, wizards and has a couple wall breakers to break into that first compartment. Once that first compartment is open, it gave, gives him access to the kingdom. And uh, he'll be able to go all the way through. You don't see a go va ho that much. Or, I mean a go va low that much because in order to make that work, just like in Town Hall 8 you got to clear all the uh, air defenses out, and most people don't put them so easily in the same place or in the core like they would in a Town Hall 8 uh, internet base. So it rages up his kill squad there with Dragon and Loons in the um, clan castle. They take care of that super, super fast, and uh, you know they don't need to jump or anything. They can make their way all the way through the core. Valks don't have really anywhere to run. They, they, I mean, they, they've got to go make it through this core. Still three air defenses up. Uh, King was going to go ahead and take care of that one. Um, the uh, Valks take care of the second, and there's only one left, and that wizard is under rage and almost gets it just with a sliver of health. Um, that air, air defense stays alive. That's just crazy. Um, that uh, hero, I guess, archer tower and possibly cannon took that, uh, that uh, suicidal kamikaze wizard out and didn't let him take care of that air defense. So send it in the loons. Both royals are up. Golem is up, uh, walking through. And they, those loons are going to come into big, big problems when they get towards uh, those Teslas, the Tri-Teslas and the Air Defense, and two Air uh, Archer Towers uh, and a Wiz Tower. There is no way that these guys are going to push through, but uh, he does have th six back-end loons, and he does have witchers up, Witches up with Larrys, um, and they're going to make their way through the base. Does he have any Witches up, or are they just Larrys? So just, just random skeletons running, an army of skeletons, with the king like he's commanding them that's pretty cool so i i think he could have waited a little bit longer to deploy his loons um you know because the queen's pushing through the king's pushing through and uh you know that archer tower is firing on all random stuff but uh he decides i would have sent the um the loons in from the right hand side the bottom right but i would have held the other ones back from the the, the left they're just not going to get that much value they trip traps and say that three times fast, and then that wizard tower completely annihilates them. So really not the, the best. Uh, Queen eats that giant bomb, but has the ability, and uh, she'll go ahead and take care of the rest. All the defenses are down, and we are just in cleanup mode. So very, very nice. It's the way to start this video off, and uh, nice attack lang. All right, number two, we're going to do a La Loon, and we're going to see Huck go ahead and take this anti-three base, and um, he's going to bring, um, I, think a, I think, a shattered entry here. So it brings the, yeah, the golem from the clan castle, one of his own golems. And he's going to bust into that 9 o'clock um, compartment and get that AD, get the uh, queen. He has a jump with him, and he has a ra two rages and a heal to go ahead and push those loons and even the kill squad through. Um, does have a poison, but don't know why he decides not to use it. That uh, Those golems are going to make their way into that compartment with the wall breakers, break it open. And uh, this uh, air defense will go down very, very, very quickly. And the, the king will take that out. Uses the jump, 
Clan Castle's trigger. Don't know why we... Maybe it was a heal on accident. Maybe you meant to use the um, poison, but no poison was used here. So they're just going to do it the old-fashioned way. Queen's doing damage, wizard's doing damage, and they take out the enemy queen as well. And the uh, enemy king goes down. So all the royals are down. Uh, and uh, we're good to go with that. The, the, there are two air defenses down already. Has three lava hounds to go ahead and take care of the rest. Sends them in from the uh, 9 o'clock or 10 o'clock position. And then the 2 o'clock position with following up with loons. Has one more rage and a haste and a worthless poison. One of the lava hounds bursts and there's nothing to cover it. So that's going to be doing some serious damage to these uh, balloons. But... Um, they're going to mass up and get it, and then the other one, uh, you know, other group takes care of that final air defense. He will have a Lava Hound that makes it through the rest of the, uh, the rate, almost full Lava Hound, which is an ever an optimal thing. I think it's like Huck's signature is just to have a Lava Hound, a fully uh, non-popped Lava Hound make it to the end of the raid. So, you know, you really want those Lava Hounds to pop to get those pups, but... Uh, you know, he still gets the three stars, uses a haste to take care of that wizard tower, has no chance, and that uh, queen is doing damage to it as well. So we are in cleanup mode. We'll fast forward it, and we'll be done. Very, very nice attack. I think that's our only La, La Loon in this war, so that we're going to show at least. All right. So just like I said, let's check this out. Okay, so see, we're attacking already. We're doing like the who hit it best. So number three, uh, go Vaho. Let's check out Rampo. Rampo begged me to put his attack in here. It said he already put a shrine in my honor inside the uh, corner in his house. So if I did not, he was going to take it down. So got to put this attack in there. Um, he's going to go ahead and, and use a shattered entry. These golems, these kind of troll Teslas pop up in front, but that's not going to be a problem. Because those golems are going to tank while the wizards go ahead and take care of that. Uh, wall breakers come and finally open up that wall. And uh, golems are reroute, drops the queen behind. And the valkyries are sent in and the funnel is created. Drops a jump in the center for them to make it all through. That clan castle, at least the, the wizard and the archer will pull the, the valkyries in there towards the core. Which is always nice. And um, same thing with the wizards. And the queen, so they'll go ahead and take care of that clan castle. And it's time to send in the hogs. Has a uh, heal left over, as I think he healed the core up for those Valkyries. But uh, most of the defense is uh, triggered on or centered on the kill squad. And look, notice all those double giant bomb spots have already been tripped. So those hogs just really have to make it through the marathon, through the long run, and they don't have to worry about any giant bomb or double giant bomb sets. So he uses that final heal to push through that. Very heavy hit point, uh, level 3 expo, and then they'll make it through the uh, archer tower and then around in a circle around the horn and finish up with the last couple point defenses of the cannon and the two archer towers as the Valkyries will take care of that uh, mortar. So we're almost in cleanup mode. Queen is completely full uh, with ability still, and King is up with uh, most of his health but no ability, and we're going to go ahead and... Uh, to fast forward to the rest of this. No poison. There is a poison still left over, and uh, don't think we're swagging it. So that's fine. We'll use it for the next raid. Very nice hit, Rampo. All right. We'll skip number four. Uh, number five, and Huck got a six-star war there. We'll check out Maddie J. And now we're out of the anti three bases. Now we're back to the internet weird, crazy bases. So he's going to use a go va lo, just like we saw in Lang's attack. And again, look at the, look at the, um, it's basically like a Town Hall 8 with Expos and uh, an extra air defense. So uh, they do have that uh, core with all four air defenses in there. So it's going to be very, very simple once those Valkyries get in to go ahead and tear through it and uh, do short uh, work on these things. So he'll send his golems in there from the bottom. Using a shattered entry brings nine Valkyries, um, beefy Valkyries, and uh, no, I'm not saying they're fat. I'm, I'm just saying they're, they're level four. So uh, dro drops a jump in there. Doesn't need to do the wall breakers. Makes make sure they all get pushed through. Again, that clan castle will grab them into the core. All those archers and wizards. Um, they're gonna they're gonna go ahead and pull that those Valkyries in there. Has two heals after that rage is, is dropped down. Drops the heal for those Valkyries. They'll go ahead and take out the king, 
and the queen and trip trip like all the giant bombs but it doesn't really matter because this is a go va lo not a go va ho so we were using loons and not hogs really preemptive heal there he's uh being very aggressive on that heal he knows they're going to make through but uh wow so they tripped the last uh, double giant bomb set and uh trip that i'm uh, not trip but go ahead and finish that last air defense already has the loons coming in they are hitting some of the black seeking mines and other uh, bomb traps but uh it's fine. This base is completely crushed, completely toasty. So that uh, one wizard tower, it just gets that uh, that loon down, and it, it it's on life support. I mean that 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 wizard tower, that wizard on that tower has one foot on the banana peel and the other on the line, and it is done. He slips off. So just a couple more defenses left, and they are not going to do anything against these loons because they are cannons. So I call it cleanup mode. Uh, Decent split. I mean, not too many loons, uh, but they are taking the, both the uh, the northeast and the southwest part of the base. Can't get any better than that. So we've got the three stars going on. Very, very nice attack. All right. So let me see which base it was. Um, maybe it was Huck's base. Let me check that base out because they used their bit this. Yeah, okay. So we're going to see who hit it best. Uh, Huck gets a six star. I should have put this on before and then I'll show my attack. Um, basically exactly the same base. This is just, uh, you know, max level um, Town Hall 9 defenses. Not the walls, but just the defenses. So he's going to use a Goho with uh, two uh, Shattered Entry with two Golems. I use a, uh, a Stone Entry. So uses Double Poison. Take out this Clan Castle. And it goes down, and he is going to come in the complete opposite end of me, which I'll show you in just a second. Uh, use that uh, Shattered Entry. Go ahead and get in there and uh, use Wall Breakers to get into that first compartment. And the way it works is, you know, they have this, like, line formed here of defenses. So these golems will go ahead and route right into that defense for some reason. I don't know why that, that golem is trying to get into the mortar when he should have got rerouted to the other defense, but... Whatever, it's AI, Supercell AI, uh, Quad Tesla's in the core. Um, you know, it doesn't matter about the air defenses. They just need to take out that queen. Doesn't have a jump, but the, um, the friendly queen will go ahead and take care of that. And now it's time to send in the hogs as that enemy queen is down. Has four heals to go ahead and heal up all these hogs. I think he brought 20-something, like 25 hogs, so it's plenty of hogs to make it through. He uses that first heal. Uh, King and Queen are both up with abilities, so that's what you want to see. Double Giant Bomb set is going to be there right by the Wizard Tower, uh, but uh, they trigger it one at a time. Don't even know if they trigger the other one. Let's just see. But uses two heals, still has another one left over. Yes, they do trigger that uh, Double Giant Bomb set one at a time, just like it is on the opposite corner, which the Queen just tripped and ate. And uh, only a few defenses left, Mortar, Wizard Tower, and Archer Tower with uh, plenty of hogs to go ahead and take those things out. And they go flying, and uh, pigs will fly. So we're in cleanup mode, and a uh, very, very nice attack. Um, pretty sure I attacked in my base earlier than that. But um, you can hit this base many different ways, as I will show you in just a second. So uh, that's one of them. I think this base is actually uh, the same base layout. Yep, the same base layout. And um, I think he brings a go Vaho. So he brought Valkyries in to take this base, and we'll f speed it up. He's going to go ahead and eliminate that double giant bomb spot, or at least uh, the eliminate the spot and actually trip one of the bombs. And we're doing the fast forward thing. Um, just because I'm trying to shorten my videos a little bit. Comes in the same angle as Huck does, uh, but we'll pick off these defenses with, uh, you know, those hogs. Uh, get some, some easy defenses. Sends that, those Valkyries, and they really, like I said on the other base, they really only have one way to go. There's that, that runway of, of defenses and, and buildings for them to go to. Drops a jump to connect that whole entire core, and uh, those, that king will go ahead and drag the Valkyries in there. Uh, they don't, will take the jump. And uh, they'll go ahead and get aggro on that queen as soon as she starts shooting. There we go. Queen goes down. Hogs are already on the back end, front end, whatever you want to call it. Following the kill squad around. Sniping off these uh, defenses one by one uh, as the other um, the kill squad's tanking for them. So some Valkyries are up. 
Uh, ho tons of hogs are up. I mean, completely crushes this base with the Go Vaho. So uh, it's another way to kill the exact same base. And then I'll show you the, the, the other way to do it with a stone Go Ho. And that's on number 13, same base. Just lesser defenses, lesser, this, this is like basically Town Hall 8 defenses, max Town Hall 8 with uh, a couple of Expos thrown in there and maybe a, maybe a, some, of, some of the lower uh, Town Hall 9s. So I was going to get the, uh, I think I hit this earlier than both, them, both the other two, so I was going to get that easy lure, uh, but the Tesla, the Troll Tesla popped up there, so just gave up. I should have sent it in from the 3 o'clock position to get the lure. No big deal. I have a beefy kill squad with three golems, uh, one from the clan castle. So I'll go ahead and start uh, funneling in there, drop a wall breaker to get in, and uh, they'll take out that last dark elixir drill and then route into the core, uh, at least that compartment, that runway. And I did bring a jump and um, uh, three heals for the hogs. Drop a poison for that clan castle. No big deal. Wizard gets lost on the way, then starts to reroute into the poison, so it is gone. Giant bombs are tripped, and uh, that uh, a queen will go ahead and get aggro to the king, and uh, the king will go ahead and smack that queen down, and it's all over for for him and, or for her. And I'll just go ahead and start trickling some hogs in there. I'll take out some easy defenses while the um, you know kill squad is tanking, and uh, they'll start to make make their way towards the right. And I'll go ahead and join them with other hogs and start doing a surgical deployment uh, on the uh, counter or the clockwise type of thing. Have three heals, drop one there, lose some to spring traps, but that's fine. We'll keep going, ring around the rosy, and uh, drop the rest of the hogs in there uh, as they'll keep continually following the ring. And uh, they'll take out the expo and uh, drop that uh, second heal. And still have one more left. Do uh, trip a giant, double giant bomb set, which eats eh, two, three hogs. No big deal. And then finally, we'll go ahead and finish this last one with just one point defense and uh, one uh, mortar. So nice hit. So I say modestly. Queen is still up. I don't know why I used her ability. I think I was holding on to the stupid minion for posterity. I did bring some extra units for those builder huts in the corners. Um... But uh, finally dropped that, uh, that minion there. Queen and uh, Hogs will go ahead and take care of that storage, uh, the gold storage. So nice hit. And uh, let's go backwards now. So we're going to do one more, and we're going to do number nine. And we're going to show Lady Mystica hitting this with uh, a Go Vaho. So did we do? Yeah, we did a Go Vaho. We did a couple of them. But uh, you know what? It's never too many Go Vahos. Uses a Quad Quake with two heals and a Rage in there brought in. And uh, we'll go ahead and bring... Uh, do we do a Shattered or Stoned? I see two of her own. Maybe... Uh, it's always like a surprise. I think, I think it's going to be a Stone entrance, though. So, drops the two of her own Golems and starts the funneling. Has Wall Breakers to get into that first compartment for that Quad Quake to work. And uh, that uh, drops the queen from behind. And uh, we'll start to take care of that, uh, that cannon. And the wall breakers get in. A clan castle is triggered. And uh, drops the goal now. Yes, there we go. A little late to the party. Uh, lost the invitation. No big deal. We'll start walking in. And no poisons for this clan castle. So that one golem is getting nicely roasted on an open fire. Uh, just like a chestnut, but those uh, the wizards will kind of help in. They'll get toasted too. So struggling a little bit with that clan castle, but the queen will go ahead and save the day. She aggro's on the loon and the dragon goes down. Um, you know the rage up the king with his ability, and now it's time to drop in the hogs and keep those two heals. Still, uh, we have a golem up or no? Uh, golemite, golem. Yeah, I think a max golem there with the uh, uh, is, is still full. Hasn't burst yet that I can see. So hogs are still going. Use one heal for that uh, first set, and then drops the second. <coughs> excuse me, drops the second heal for that um, hogs. That those hogs that are coming in from the three o'clock. Tons of hogs go flying, but uh, it's okay. There's only a couple more defenses left. Three point defenses. That cannon goes down. Two more uh, archer tower. And fortunately for those hogs, that queen is. Uh, um, Tanking and will take it out by herself. 
Never send a hog in to do what an archer queen, an archer queen's job. Is that what it is? Look at those pesky builder huts in the corner, though. Ah, you got to check that out. That's uh, extra 30 seconds is not going to make that a problem, but they will go all around the base before they start running for that. That golem, they, those golems know what's up. They're, they're, they know what's going on here. They're like, we, we're not going to get stuck on time here for, with, the, with this builder hut in there. So uh, they will walk around the base, and the hogs and the clean will clean everything else up. So very, very nice. Great war from WHF Rising. Way to get another perfect in there. Uh, we will be doing some arrange in the very near future. I'll keep posting that stuff up. But, um, yeah, so, uh, you know, go ahead and uh, take a look at the compositions. Take a look at the deployments. You know, practice it. Get those uh, six-star wars and practice those three-star attacks.